I'm going good, thanks. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for having me. Um, so you brought your guitar along. Yeah. I thought maybe you could play us a song and then we'll have a bit more of a chat. Is that cool? That is cool. I'll play one called I Wish You Were My Son. See you. Live in the Radio Adelaide studios, Jamie C. Fang from the Sunbirds. That was great. Um, Thanks. Yeah, thank you. Um, so, Jamie, the Sunbirds kind of started out as a solo project for you. Yeah. Um, is, that, is that right? Yeah, kind of. I just re- recorded some songs at home for fun and showed them to my friends. And are the songs still yours? Like, do you still do most of the writing? Yeah, yeah. I sort of write the basic kind of guitar parts and words and that kind of stuff and yeah everyone chips in there so i guess what we kind of heard is like maybe what like an embryonic songbird song sounds yeah. like you know yeah that's kind of like what i came to the band with and then sort of we jazzed it up a little bit yeah after that yeah so i guess like um in your bio and, and you can definitely hear it like there's there's influences of kind of 90s dinosaur junior song the kind of yeah songwritery kind of stuff um totally 
and that, and that's going on. But when you, when you bring the songs to the rest of the band, they've been in like various projects like Ride into the Sun. Uh, Florentina was in the Aves for quite a while. Mm. Um, do they do they bring kind of other styles to the table? Yeah, yeah. We all kind of are into different stuff, and I try not to like dictate too much. Like oh, you have to sound like Sonic Youth or whatever. <laughs> um, but that's kind of what I'm into, and I mean everyone's sort of into that stuff to some degree. But yeah, I just. I don't know, everyone's got a good style, so I let them do whatever. It's never been, like, cross-paths tension going on <laughs> down <there. laughs> We've had some debates about Kanye West, but... Uh, oh, yeah? Where do you stand? Uh, <laughs> still undecided. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you could get some Safe hip-hop. answer here. <laughs> <laughs> you could get some, like, beats happening, maybe. Yeah, yeah, that's the, right. Well, we've got a work. keyboard player. Don't so. take my advice. <laughs> Look at Seb's face. Oh, that's a terrible idea. No. <laughs> it's not a terrible idea. <laughs> it's just not very good. <laughs> um, so you guys have your EP launch this Saturday night, and it's the EP is called Emergency Christmas. What is an emergency Christmas? Why why would we throw an emergency Christmas? Right. Yeah, it's a bit of an abstract name, I guess. Um, we just thought it was kind of funny because um, when we were recording at our French friend's beach house um we had like we filled the whole house with our gear and it was a total mess and then like we wanted to have dinner you know and all we had was this like little fold out plastic table that we kind of you know set up over the top of guitars on the ground and cables everywhere and stuff and you know had our little banquet and had our board games on it and stuff i don't know it just kind of felt like we would, you know, trying our best to have a Christmassy time. <laughs> nice, yeah. I don't know if that makes sense. Sounds lovely. When I read it, it reminded me of this time I went to the reject shop and they had these bags of emergency ponchos. <laughs> and and they're, they're like the plastic bags you put over your head when it's raining. But when I read that, I was like, yeah, when you really need to have like a... Yeah. Some kind of Mexican party and you don't have like your regular poncho. Exactly. But you always carry... You've got your emergency one. Yeah. Yeah, so we kind of thought... an emergency Christmas. Yeah, like, you know, if, if you, you know, you've got a family and your kids are in a really bad mood one day, like... <laughs> Once a year, you should be able to throw an emergency Christmas to kind of bring <laughs> it's everyone a great idea. together. Bring yeah. everyone together. Christmas is a good time. Totally. Yeah. Um, so, so the copy of the EP we've got here is just a burnt CDR with a nice yeah. little, like, really, really nicely handwritten um, track list oh. and everything. Oh. But the, the one on su- Saturday is going to be a bit different. Is that right? Yes, it's going to be, you know, all EP'd up. Um, it's still going to be a CD, you know. It's a bit of a sort of late 90s medium that we really want to support mm. mm-hmm. <laughs> but it will have some nice pictures on it a lot of stuff. people right now are feeling probably old when they hear about nostalgia for CDs, <laughs> CDs. <That's right. laughs> we're bringing it in <laughs> yeah it's still accessible everyone yeah. can play a CD totally mm. um, so yeah you're, you're playing the launch on Saturday night with a few other bands Naomi Kate and yeah um, Big Richard Insect Big Richard Insect Horror My Friend Horror My Friend should be good uh, are there any other shows coming up on the horizon? Any touring or? Um, uh, we're trying to work out maybe playing in Melbourne, getting some grant money and stuff. But actually, we don't really have anything definitely in the calendar. So everyone has to come to the EP launch if they want to see us. Might be your last chance. You never know. <laughs> no, but we're planning on doing a bunch of stuff. We'll listen out for that. Thanks so much for coming yeah. in, Jamie. Thanks. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll take a track with the um, the full Sunbirds lineup of that EP now. Um, I shook the first track lead track off the EP. Can you tell us a little bit about this one? Um, yeah, it's a song that we kind of have been playing for a little while. It's sort of about, I don't know, just revelations that come to you when you've been sitting in front of the TV for a really long time, trying to be creative with a packet of chips in hand. <laughs> nice. Sounds great. Cool. It's like the, the ideal creative process. Totally. Here at some <laughs> Jamie, thanks for joining us. Cheers. You're on the range.
like music? Do you like live music? How about live local music beamed straight from their amps to your ear holes? From metal to pop, punk to rockabilly, acoustic, psychedelic, electro, hip hop, funk, folk, and everything else in between. Every Tuesday night from 7 pm on Radio Adelaide, local noise brings the best local acts live to air, straight to you.